Hi there, I'm Professor Blackmore and I'm coming back to you today with a remake or what we call a remix of a prior video that I did on the Nano Teleprompter. And I'm inspired to do this remake or remix uh, because uh, someone uh, watched the video, they took the time to watch the video, and I want to use some of that feedback just to go over step by step so that others can learn just how easy it is to use this very easy teleprompter resource. All right, so if you want to watch the first video that I did, you'll go to YouTube and you'll see on my YouTube channel, you'll see this purple background with the green coloring on it. And the new video is going to have the same look so that you can see all of the nano teleprompter videos together if you like to do that. And so the first thing that you want to do is you want to download the nano teleprompter app. Okay. So I promised you that I'm going to go step by step. And so what you want to do is you want to go out to your app store and you're going to be looking for a app that looks like this, this bottom one right here that has a little orange uh, triangle on it. And it says nano teleprompter. I'm going to touch it just so you can see it. Uh, but if I were to go out to my Google uh, Play Store, And just put in nano and then you can select it from there and then there it is right there now it's telling me that I need to update mine but I'm gonna do that later but when you get ready to install this app all you have to do is just install it from your uh, Play Store or if you're using a Apple product from wherever you would go for that now once you do that part then what you want to do is you want to type out your script okay and so when i get ready to do a script i just use word now there are other ways to do this and other people have shared with me how they do it but i'm going to show you first what i do here okay now you don't have to do any fancy font or anything none of that is going to transfer over when you uh, transfer this script over to uh, nano teleprompter but i'm just going to make it just a little bit bigger so you can see it here so this is going to be my script Okay, so now my script is completed. I'm gonna go ahead and save it. And I keep my scripts just right on my desktop so that they will be handy for me to use them whenever I need to. And so here I'm gonna save that right in that folder that's on my desktop. Now I am gonna go out to my Google Drive, okay? So here is my Google Drive right here. All right. And then here in my Google Drive is where I have my scripts. And so I'm going to upload a new script here. Go straight to my scripts on my desktop and I'm going to find my nano, nano teleprompter app script. All right. Now that is being uploaded to my Google Drive as we speak and it's done as you can see here by this check. So now I'm going to go back over to my device. Now when you download that app you want to download it on the device that you're going to use as your teleprompter. I use this device as my teleprompter okay. So I'm going to go ahead and open the app now, I have 
scripts that are already in here, but I know that this script that I just made is not here. So I need to hit this red plus sign right here. So I'm going to go ahead and hit it. And then I need to go up to the top here and hit open file. When I go to open file, hopefully all of my scripts will be here. But if it's not, then I just need to refresh and wait for it to appear. All right. And there it is. There's my nano teleprompter. All right. So now I'm just going to go ahead and select that. Now I have my nano teleprompter script into the app. Okay. Now I'm going to show you what to do next. Okay. So now that we have our script already uploaded to the nano teleprompter app, and so all you have to do is just press this play button to start. And it's just that easy. You'll get a countdown. Uh, I have a 10 second countdown here, but in the settings, you can set up a lot of different things in here. And so it'll just go just like this. Now there are some settings down here in the bottom that you can get to very quickly, but you can go up here to your settings. And you can change all different. I'm going to go ahead and open the settings. Okay. And so I can make my font size a little bigger if I want to. I can change that 10 second delay and make it 20 seconds or 12 seconds if I want to. And then this allows you to do space intervals between the lines. So if I wanted to increase that just a little bit, and then here, uh, full screen settings, margin 4%. I can increase that if I wanted to. Now I'm going to go back and see what I get from that. And so now you can see that those selections that I have made are now saved. And so you can see that it's a bigger text size is going a little bit faster. I may want to slow that down a little bit. I can do that from here. And it'll go a little bit slower. Now as a bonus, I just wanted to show you that you can also change the background on your teleprompter. And so it's just that easy to use. And so if you've enjoyed this video and my tips, I want to ask that you please subscribe to my YouTube channel and click the bell so you won't miss any of my tips. And please also follow me on Instagram.